This pregnant waitress started her shift at work as if it were any other day for her, but she did not realize that something would happen during her day that would change her life and make her burst into tears. What possibly could have happened to this young lady? But before we start, smash the like button and make sure to subscribe if you haven't, and hit that notification bell so that you won't miss any new stories. Today was more of a struggle than usual. She had grown really big during her third trimester. She had heavy feet and an achy back so she waddled over, collecting the bill and the dishes at the table. Shit is sh However, the officer had already left. When she opened the folder that contained the check, there was a note that the police officer had written. She couldn't help herself and ran directly to her manager, struggling to contain her tears. Even though Courtney Cadigan was already eight months pregnant, she continued to work the shifts that she could manage at the Lamp Post Diner. Or since, since she was going to become a mother, she knew that it was really important to work hard and save the money that she could. Being a waiter or waitress is an extremely hard job. Many people don't realize that these people are on their feet for hours at a time and they make really low salaries. Also, many customers don't tip nearly enough, which doesn't help the cause. The diner had regulars, including policemen who would come in to have a quick bite prior to the start of their shift. Corny was used to serving them. But that day, there was one officer whom she didn't recognize. Kent, upon leaving the diner, he left a note for Corny together with the bill. This was quite surprising, to say the least, and she wasn't ready for it. She had never gotten a note like this in the past. And her due date, which was April Fool's, loomed ever nearer and Corny was worried about making ends meet. It did not help that her relationship with her child's father had ended badly, and she now needed to face motherhood alone. All these thoughts were running through her mind when the cop walked in and sat down in her section. She went over to bring him a menu and woo and welcomed him to the joint. Courtney tried not to put meaning into it by ignoring her thoughts and approached the officer to take his order, just like she would with any other customer. However, the encounter just became stranger from there. Courtney's ex hadn't made contact with her for a while, which was quite worrying. She wanted him to get involved in his child's life as much as possible in spite of their relationship not ending on the best terms. When the mysterious officer came into the diner, Courtney felt slightly uncomfortable. She was pretty sure she had not seen him before, and now that she was speaking, T carefully studied his face, trying to place him. Courtney only wholly hoped that it didn't involve her ex or that she wasn't in some kind of trouble. However, the stony face of the officer did nothing to dispel her fears. Courtney desperately tried to exchange pleasantries with the man and tried to engage him in some small talk. However, each time that she tried to comment about the weather, his order or anything, he just nodded and gave her a tight smile, shutting her down. So his order was a green salad and he asked for a glass of water. Courtney felt relieved to get out of the awkward situation, but she was well aware that he was watching her intently as she waddled into the kitchen. When Courtney came through the swing doors, she noticed the diner had filled up. Another couple was now seated at the booth that was behind the officer. She rushed to them and introduced herself. They noticed her enormous baby bump and tired eyes right away. Courtney brushed aside the couple's concern with an explanation. Courtney later recalled, I was telling the people at the table beth and table behind him that it was my first baby, and she added, I was going out of work soon. Before placing their orders, the couple warmly congratulated her, unaware that the police officer was listening to every word intently. When Courtney brought him his salad and went to the other customers to serve them, he watched her even more. The mysterious man ate his salad very quickly and drank his water in record time. After that, he raised his hand to ask for the check. It's the total came to $9 and Courtney brought the bill over. The diner was getting busier and busier, so Courtney was off again. She went about her duties. When Courtney opened the leather folder, she discovered there was enough cash to pay for the meal. However, she also saw a note which made her knees weak. Courtney picked up the note and read it slowly and carefully. She couldn't believe her eyes. The note on the bill read, enjoy your first. You will never forget it. So next to the note was $9 in change. How nice he was for wishing her luck. But then she looked down at the tip amount and she almost fell over. She couldn't help herself and she ran directly to her manager crying. She went into the back room with the check in hand. And when her boss saw that her employee was distraught, she thought something terrible had happened. His baby, was it a mistake? Maybe he couldn't see very well and thought his bill was more than it actually was. And or maybe he meant to write $10 instead of $100? Although these scenarios both sounded unlikely, Courtney couldn't believe he actually meant to leave a $100 tip. Courtney followed up by saying, We didn't really even talk. I brought him his menu, he ordered a salad and I got it for him. While I was telling the people at the table behind him that it was my first baby he must have overheard and decided to step in. Courtney couldn't believe that someone would do something so kind for her, especially a complete stranger. Courtney hurried to the parking lot and hope hoping that he hadn't left yet, but her heart fell when she discovered that he wasn't there anymore. She wondered how she would find him. She didn't even even catch the nice man's name. After Courtney's shift shift, she went back home and called the Voorhees Township Police Department right away. 
she wanted to track down the officer. She also shared with her father Brian what had happened to her. Her father was really taken aback by the rather generous tip, so he shared a picture of the note Courtney received on Facebook. He wrote, What a wonderful person to not only leave a very generous tip but a lovely message too. He continued, It's not the amount, it's the humanity of it Brian commented. He saw she was struggling and a young girl. She was working in a diner while pregnant, standing with that kind of weight on her, and it was his way of saying, I understand your struggle. However, the mystery officer actually did more on that day. He impacted Courtney's dad in an incredible way, one that would stay with him long after the day came to a close. What are we talking about exactly? In his Facebook post, Brian wrote, You always hear about how bad the police are, how they treated you like dirt, how they are on a power trip, he added. I am sure there are some bad apples, but most of them are just doing their jobs. Brian's opinion of police officers has been forever changed because of the generous officer. Brian's Facebook post became viral almost overnight, and it garnered an impressive 10,000 reactions, thousands of shares, and a thousand comments. People wanted to know more about Courtney's story. Since her father's post became viral, people from around the world have contacted Courtney. A lot of people called the Lamp Post Diner so that they could contact her. Most people wanted to donate money in order to help her out. The generous mystery officer chose to stay anonymous. It seems that simply knowing he helped Courtney when she was in need was enough for him. Would this be enough for Courtney or did she seek more? Hey, Taddy. However, Courtney and her dad wanted to show their appreciation. They wondered how they could do that when they didn't know the officer's identity. They decided to show their gratitude the only way that they knew how. So maybe the father and daughter duo went to the Voorhees Police Department and brought boxes of donuts for the whole team. But that's not the end to this story dot 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 are you thinking about Courtney's baby and whatever happened? Well, she gave birth to a beautiful healthy baby girl. If that wasn't exciting enough, there's another twist to the story. Courtney's ex-boyfriend and the baby's daddy is back in the picture. The couple made amends just before their beautiful girl was born. And boy are we glad. They can now begin their beautiful life together as a family. Baby Kaylee Ann was born on April 6th at 7 pounds 3 ounces. She was brought into the world with tons of love and a loving mother and father who would always look after her. What a lucky little girl. And we're glad to say that Courtney is thriving as a new mother. And just as she was a great weight waitress, she has carried over her hard work and dedication to parenting. For now, she's taken a break from the diner though. Not because of anything in particular, just because she wanted to focus on her little girl and take a break from the constant hustle. It's guessed, although she stepped away from the diner. For now, Courtney will never forget her experience that one day. Although $100 doesn't go too far with a newborn, the kindness and thought alone is worth millions. Courtney was having a rather rough day when she received the $100 tip. It not only put a smile on her face, but also eased her, raised her nerves a bit about having a baby and all of the financial burdens involved. Courtney appeared on numerous news channels after receiving the generous tip. The world was enthralled with the story and the act of kindness this police officer did for a mom-to-be. It warmed the hearts of many Americans. But Courtney hoped people were at Jack and Cool were able to see how much it meant to her as a working mom and as a waitress. This, it is known that wait staff or ushers paint her often stiffed, so it means a lot when the opposite happens for a change. She also hoped women saw the story and felt more confident to work while pregnant. Courtney believes it is totally normal and natural for a mom to work and support her family. She hopes she has helped women around the country who are expecting or planning for kids in the future. Courtney hopes to get back to her happy place soon, but for now, she's enjoying spending time with her family and watching her beautiful baby girl grow up. Courtney knew saving up before she gave babe birth was the right thing to do. Baby Kaylee Ann is sir so lucky to grow up with such inspiring and hardworking parents. We think that kids who see their parents work hard pays off for them in the long run. We bet she'll grow up to be motivated just like her parents. 